The following video is for educational purposes only. This is to help students and reviewers for their upcoming quizzes, exams, or board exams. If there are any suggestions, corrections regarding the video, and or additional topics that you wanted us to discuss or elaborate, do not hesitate to comment your opinions. Thank you and enjoy watching. Episode 8, Saracenic Architecture from 7th Century Geographical Influence The Muslim faith flourished principally in the countries of Southern Asia and North Africa. The spread of Islam has been frequently associated with military conquest, racial movements, and in some cases with the consequent displacement of established populations. The most important movements were the Arab expansion northwards and westwards out of the Arabian Peninsula and the drive of the Turkish and Mongol groups south, southeast, and southwest of Central Asia. Geological Influence Brick making and pie walling was almost universal in the Alluvian plains. Marble was generally available as an article of trade. There was a long tradition of ceramic production, use of gypsum plasters, glass manufacture, and the various forms of metal work. Climatic Influence Islam tends to be fertile by irrigation rather than rainfall. The greater part of the Muslim lies within the grip of some form of continental climate, with the extremes of temperature and modest rainfall. Excessive sunshine has produced a tendency towards wide eaves and sheltering arcades, while window openings are minimized and rainwater disposal is neglected. The cooling effect of structures with very heavy walls and high rooms has been widely exploited. Religious Influence The effects of these beliefs on Islamic architecture can be seen in the following characteristics. There is no essential differentiation techniques between buildings with a directly religious connotation and other buildings. A direct social community purpose, including worships, decorations to abstract using geometric and plant motif. Basic conservatism discouraged innovations in favor of established forms. Architectural character, sober and grotesque. Distinguishing features The use of horseshoe arc Tunnel of stones in bricks Rich surface of decoration in carved stones, mosaic and painting Types of arc commonly used Examples of structures The Dome of the Rock, Jerusalem its builder is Raha ibn Haywa and Yasid ibn Salam, built approximately 691 AD. Its location is in Temple Mount in the Old City of Jerusalem. This structure is probably the most fundamentally important Islamic structure. It consists of a great central dome covering the summit Mount Moriah. The Great Mosque, Damascus. Its builder is Umayyad Caliph al-Walid. The mosque holds massive importance in the Christianity and Islam because of its historical and eschatological reports and events associated with the mosque. The Madrasa and the Tomb of Sultan Hassan Cairo, built approximately 1363 and it is located in Cairo, Egypt. The mosque was considered remarkable for its massive size and innovative architectural components and still considered one of the most impressive historic monuments in Cairo today. Taj Mahal Its builder is Ustad Ahmad Lahawri, built approximately 1632-1653, located at Agra, Uttar Pradesh, India. This structure is an ivory-white marble 
and it is a mausoleum on the south bank of the Yamuna River in the Indian city of Agra. The Great Mosque, Chiron Tonisla, built approximately 670 AD or CE, located at Chiron, Tunisia. It is a mosque situated in the UNESCO World Heritage Town of Kairouan, Tunisia, and one of the most impressive and largest Islamic monuments in North Africa. Terminologies Chateau, Kiosk, Dar, Men's Apartment, Diwan, Palaces, Harem, Women's Apartment, Mirab, a prayer niche facing Mecca in a mosque. Nimber, a raised platform for ceremonial announcement. Minaret, a tall slender tower connected to the mosque. It is a prayer tower. Nimbar, a high pulpit or ambo. Muhadar, a baluster. Selamuk, men's quest quarter.